Introduction An abscess is a confined collection of pus surrounded by inflamed tissue. Treatment of an abscess is primarily through incision and drainage, IND. Smaller abscesses, 5 mm, may resolve spontaneously with the application of warm compresses and antibiotic therapy. Larger abscesses will require IND. Incision and drainage of abscess, e.g., carbuncle, suppurative hydratinitis, cutaneous or subcutaneous abscess, cyst, furuncle, or peronychia, simple or single, complicated or multiple. Physician makes a small incision and leaves the surgical wound open to allow for continued drainage. In 1061, the physician may place a Penrose latex drain or gauze strip packing to allow continued drainage. Complicated cysts may require later surgical closure. The patient's abscess was located left medial thigh. Area was anesthetized with 10 ml of 1% lidocaine with epinephrine. The abscess was incised with a scalpel and moderate amount of purulent drainage was expressed. Penrose latex drain was placed. The patient tolerated the procedure well. The patient's abscess was located left arm. The abscess was incised with a scalpel and moderate amount of purulent drainage was expressed. The patient tolerated the procedure well. The patient's abscess was located in left and right knee. Both abscesses were incised with a scalpel and moderate amount of purulent drainage was expressed. The patient tolerated the procedure well. Incision and drainage of pilonidal cyst, simple. Complicated. Pilonidal cysts are located in the sacrococcygeal region above the buttocks. An incision is made to allow drainage of cystic fluid or exudate. Curatage is performed to remove the cystic epithelial lining. The wound heals secondarily depends on local wound care. Report 10081 if the procedure is more complicated and requires excision of tissue, primary closure, and slash or z-plasty. Pilonidal cyst was anesthetized with 10 ml of 1% lidocaine with epinephrine. The cyst was incised with a scalpel and high amount of purulent drainage was expressed. Procedure required excision of tissue with Z-plasty wound closure. The patient tolerated the procedure well. Example 10080 Pilonidal cyst was anesthetized with 10 ml of 1% lidocaine with epinephrine. The cyst was incised with a scalpel and low amount of purulent drainage was expressed. Wound is left with open. The patient tolerated the procedure well. Drainage external ear, abscess, or hematoma, simple. Complicated. Occasionally, a small drain tube is inserted and packing is placed to facilitate healing. A bolster with through and through sutures is placed to prevent accumulation of fluid. In a complicated procedure, the physician also devotes more time to cleaning the abscess cavity, and a soft sponge is placed in the canal after antibiotic ear drops have been applied. Drainage of abscess, parotid, simple. Parotid, complicated. The physician drains an abscess of the parotid gland. An incision is made intraorally through the tissue overlying the gland. The physician dissects through the tissue overlying the abscess. The abscess is opened with a surgical instrument and the fluid is drained. Drainage of extraperitoneal lymphocele to peritoneal cavity, 
open. The physician drains a lymphocele to the peritoneal cavity. The physician creates an opening in a lymphatic swelling or cavity, lymphocele, located outside the abdominopelvic walls to drain the material contained within to a cavity of the peritoneum. Irrigation of the lymphocele is performed. The incision is sutured closed. Drainage of perineal urinary extravasation, uncomplicated. Complicated. The physician drains urine that has passed out of the urethra, extravasation, into the perineal tissue. The physician makes an incision through the skin over the site. The incision is carried to the extravasation for drainage. Following drainage, the incision is closed with sutures. Drainage of abscess, cyst, hematoma, vestibule of mouth, simple. Complicated. The physician drains an abscess, a cyst, or a hematoma within the vestibule of the mouth. The vestibule consists of the mucosal and submucosal tissue of the lips and cheeks within the oral cavity, not including the dentoalveolar structures. The physician makes an incision in the tissue overlying the abscess, cyst, or hematoma. Tissues are dissected and the fluid is drained. Complicated drainage for larger lesions or drainage requiring multiple incisions. The physician may place a drain to facilitate healing. If a drain is placed, it is later removed. Incision and drainage of finger abscess, simple. Complicated, e.g., felon. The physician drains an abscess located in a finger. The physician lances an abscess located in the cutaneous tissue of a finger. In 26,011, the abscess just reaches deep subcutaneous tissue and requires debridement and irrigation. The wound may be left open to drain.